You know, it's always been something I've always pondered. Why do you come on my channel consistently with such a strong opinion of the exact opposite? Offering your wisdom and getting offended when I don't accept your wisdom. I understand now. It was something that I, I just always thought like, it just doesn't make sense. Why are you still here? I completely understand. Yes, I'm literally on the rooftop and I'm not coming down. I'm not going down there to get any of my clothes, nothing. Nobody's going to make me come down from the roof because I've already fleed to the mountains. And I've always said, these are all welcome on my channel, if you show some respect. I don't feel like I've been getting much respect, uh, because people are pushing their, their, uh, their strong opinions on me. And um, if you're just a regular person, why would you get offended if I don't believe you? That's the, um, that's the... That's the line in the sand. I think that's that's the. I think when Christ was writing, in uh, in the sand, like the ground, I, he was writing something like that. beautiful up here. See those big ass ginormous uh, bass drums? Yeah, me too. These floors are crazy. I just have to keep in mind that um, agents didn't want to get up from behind a computer in the first place. And now they are. 
So now that they are, they're kind of stuck between a rock and a hard place. Because how hard is it to sit there and have to watch my videos when you despise me? Like, big time despise me. That's gotta be tough. I mean, it would be hard for me to do. Because that's why I can't even watch SJD's videos. Because I I get a... Well, it's just like in, it's inviting demons into your uh, soul. Just listening to the words. Because you know what they are. Isn't that why, um, isn't that why the people that used to watch him don't watch him anymore? Because he sickens you? Like, like, unfortunately it's just the truth. He sickens you. So you can't tolerate it anymore, so you stop watching. Therefore, um, you won't have, you know, you have your strong opinion, right? But you're gonna move on. You're gonna, you're just gonna go like this. All right, fine. Don't listen. See you. But when your job is what it is, you have to watch. I remember Steve. He told me about. Now nah, I don't know about Global Witness, whatever. But he has some truth, just like everybody does. But you're assigned to watch him, and you told me it sickens you. I said, well, why do you watch him then? Well, I have to. I have to see what the, what the opposition is saying. But he sickens me. I understand the feeling. But fortunately, I don't have to continue to watch. This job is easy. It's pleasant. Um, yeah, I have to get up from behind the computer and physically drive somewhere and and uh, physically like put stuff together. I mean, I'm just borrowing somebody's tools and I, I actually just climbed up on the rooftop. I'm pretending to work here because because that's um because that's what I've that's what I was told by Scotty Potty, um, Lottie Dotty. Uh, he likes to. He likes to potty with his mouth and SJD. You, the reason why I can tell that you are all in cahoots is because you say the same thing. Uh, Robin's a CIA agent. He he uh, he he pretends he goes to work and he really doesn't. Yeah, Steve, you watch me every single day. You know exactly where I'm at every single day, all day long. already know how long this video is gonna be and you're like well thank God it's only gonna be 14 minutes and like something seconds because that's all I have left and I got to delete the rest of the video so I can make some longer videos but you hate it man all you guys hate it that's why you're trying to cause division with me and anybody else who's around that wants to communicate with me Anybody. 
I mean, good luck. You know, in the beginning it worked. You know, it did. But there's a couple of people you can't you can't tear me from, man. You know, and I know how hard you tried. And that's why you've gotten more and more disgusted with me. Out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. The one person that stuck up for you the most, and this is how I get treated. Well, you know, you know that father you're talking about? Yeah, he's got a he's got a big uh He's got a big surprise for you, Steve. He's going to humble you. That's what he's going to do. For all your efforts that you've been trying to do, all your life, think about it. You spent all that time studying the Bible, decoding all the words, but yet you don't understand it. That's crazy, ain't it? You're a typical Pharisee and a Sadducee. You just are. And you're, and you're, I'm sorry. Justin corrected me yesterday because I do accept correction. Uh, he told me I was saying dominions when it's minions. I said, oh, okay. I'll make sure that I address it next time with Steve and his minions. But, uh, hey, House of David, you got to get your roof fixed soon, right? Coming up this, this spring, right? Because it says don't come down from the rooftops. And you're literally, literally trying to push that. You and your A-frame, bloodshed, A-frame, gable, uh, pyramid roof that you want to keep stressing blood pyramid Illuminati <laughs> I'm not trying to hide who I am but I'm going to constantly lie to your face anyway and I'm going to have my minions do the same thing they're going to constantly try to cling boy do I know what it means to be clung by flatteries I mean God I just didn't think it was going to be that bad, man. I mean, uh, dude, that's the true, true definition. When you won't just let go and move on to the next channel, it's like, it's like if I kept putting on, uh, uh, RuPaul, a, a drag, drag RuPaul, the drag queen. It's like, if I kept putting that, how do I know about, don't worry about it, all right? It's like if I kept putting that channel on, and I'm just like, oh, God, why don't you just be a man? And then, I, and then I'll watch it next thing. Would you just be a man already? And then watch the next thing. When will you be a man? That's how you guys are. Change the fucking channel already if you don't like what you're hearing. 